Located in the heart of downtown Knoxville on the corner of Summit Hill and Gay Street, WDVX Radio broadcasts daily from the Knoxville Visitor Center at 89.9 FM. The station provides an eclectic mix of bluegrass, Americana, and old-time music to listeners around the world and broadcasts a live show in studio six days a week called the Blue Plate Special in which local and touring acts perform in front of a live studio audience. Few people know, however, that WDVX actually started in 1997 and has only been broadcasting out of the Knoxville Visitor Center since 2004. Before that, WDVX broadcast out of a small camper in Norris, Tennessee. And a friend of mine had said something to me about, Tony, won't you just put that thing in the campground? I went, Tony, won't you just put that thing in the campground? What? Why not? So I went down and saw the guy, and I saw Bob, and um, and I told him, I said, uh, do you, uh, have you ever thought about having a radio station in your campground? And he's like, no. And uh, he said, well, I said, well, we got a station license, and we need to see that mountaintop over there to where we can uh, microwave our signal to that, our transmitter site. And he says, do you have a camper? And I said, no, no. And he says, well, I got one down here. I don't know if it's big enough or not, but I'll show it to you. Took me down there, and it was a 14-footer, and I was, visions of the, of the caboose came back to me, and it was like, plenty big enough, Bob. Lawson founded the station in 1997 in a Norris area campground, and WDVX has been broadcasting music for East Tennessee ever since. DJ Grace Tonsing has been with WDVX since 1999 and has been a huge part of the station's rise. Honey, I didn't know Bill Monroe from a hole in the ground when I showed up at the camp or I come knocking on the door just, I mean, green as the day is long and told Tony, teach me, I'll do it for free. And and it, it, the rest is history. But, um, but uh, that was back in 1999 when I first started with the station and uh, they decided to put me on the air as, as a paid employee after a couple of months. And um, it's, it's, it's just been fun. Daniel Kimbrough is now the sound engineer for the Blue Plate Special, but his history with WDVX began back in the camper days. As far as my performing history goes with WDVX, I started uh, performing on the precursor to the Blue Plate Special, which was called Local Licks at 6, and that was... Uh, uh, WDBX used to be broadcast out of a trailer, a camper trailer, up in Clinton, Tennessee. And I guess I started the first, the first time I performed with uh, my mom and dad's bluegrass band, Mountain Soul. Uh, I guess I was a, I was either an eighth grade or a freshman in high school. It's right around. From local licks at six to the Blue Plate Special, WDVX has a long history with live music. I think it's, uh, of course, doing a live show here every day. It gives our, our people, you know, our wonderful people, a stage to perform on and to be seen and to be heard. Uh, we've seen the, uh, the venues that have opened up in town, and we've seen the moving of musicians to Knox. We've seen people pick up instruments and start playing and singing and lessons that people get to teach. And, you know, that makes me feel great. I love this place. I love what it stands for. I love the music. I love the people. It's just like one big family to me. And now, through moving downtown to Knoxville, it, it has become, WDVX is, is, is as much a part of Knoxville as Knoxville is a part of WDVX. It's a very symbiotic relationship, I think. WDVX now reaches over a thousand people daily through their radio broadcasts, online streaming, and social media, and was named by the Oxford American as probably the best radio station in the world. WDVX now boasts listeners from around the United States and all over the world who tune in to listen to music that otherwise would not be heard on the radio. Initially, I didn't know it was going to be the, completely like this style of music. It was going to be way much more diverse. But the thing I had really had to overcome initially was fear. Uh, fear of several things. And uh, even the fear of success. I guess this this place would me. not be here if it wasn't for Tony Lawson. I know it's not like not the American way to sing the praises of your boss, but love the man, love the man. From a small camper in Norris, Tennessee to a world-renowned musical destination, WDVX is here to stay. For TNJN, this is David Cohen.